Hey, what's up, you guys? Chelsea Briggs here, hanging out backstage at the Woody Awards, joined by London Grammar. Hey, guys. Hello. Hi. How's it going? Good, thank you. excited to be here. What are you most looking forward to with the show tonight? Apparently it's a really good PA. I'm excited about that because okay. South by Southwest sometimes you have PAs where it cuts out and no one's hearing anything. Don't so. worry about that hopefully this time around. No, apparently MTV is. Well I have to say this is your first time at South by Southwest but you opened for Coldplay. Like how crazy is that? It was quite crazy you know they're a band that the three of us have loved for a long time and obviously one of the most important bands of you know, generation, so it was amazing. It was a real honor to do that. Are you guys like this with Chris Martin now? <laughs> we were hanging out with him a bit, yeah. It's cool. He was incredibly lovely uh, and just amazing to us, and it was very overwhelming, actually. It was incredible. I love that you guys are so humble. Was it, was it like, nerve-wracking, though, like, being like, oh, this is Chris Martin watching us perform before? Yeah, um, I was saying earlier that we always get really nervous all the time anyway, doing any show. And then 15 minutes before we were about to go on stage, he just wandered into our dressing room and we were like... <laughs> and he just sort of really just nonchalant. Give a, you know, just, yeah. He could have given us some preparation time, you know, but he just, he just wandered in. Were you guys cool, calm and collected or was there like a little bit of fan? I just come out of the <laughs> toilet I just come, and my hands were wet. So then I kind of looked up. Like, uh, I shook his hand and then he said to me, he's, I looked up at his face, he's like, hi, I'm Chris. I said, oh, I know who you are. <laughs> And nominated for a Brit Award this year. You guys have had such a crazy year. Was that such a surreal moment for you guys? Or where were you when you found out about that? We were in Australia. And I remember watching the, the show on TV because it was in Australia. It was the start of the morning, whereas obviously it was a late night show in the UK. But it was just, it was just a crazy. It was, it was nice because it was just sort of an end note to what was a crazy year for us. So. Do you guys have like a highlight of the year at all that stands out? I know there's probably so many, but maybe like the first thing that comes to mind when I ask you that. Last night, not night before last, opening for Coldplay, that was one. Um, and also I think being in Australia, we did some shows in front of loads of like really big crowds and that was really exciting. How is it being in the States? Is it kind of a surreal thing? Are like the fans different at all, would you say? The fans have been amazing. I think we've been overwhelmed actually by like the reception we've had since we've been here and everyone's just been incredibly lovely to us from the minute we got here. So um, it's, it's been great, it's been great. And I love the story because you guys met on Facebook. That's what I heard, right? Can we talk about this for a second? Because it's so interesting to me. Um, that's that's not how we met. Is it not? No. Wait. So why? So why is that? Why is that the rumor? Um, it's the you explain. It. <laughs> so basically, me and Hannah did kind you of get that go, question all the time. First of all, <laughs> well, everyone because everyone thinks I'm really weird about this because I saw a picture of Hannah. Basically, I saw a picture on, of Hannah on Facebook okay. with the guitar, and that's kind of how I found out that she was a musician, and um, that was when we first started playing and writing music together okay. because of that picture so awesome. I didn't actually just stalk her and see a picture. I'm, I'm so judging you before I was yeah. like oh this guy the creeper to my left so <laughs> I, yeah. um, and your album obviously the physical copy is coming out um, in the US what would you say about this album what is it that you're most proud of that you're most excited about because there's some songs that are coming out that no one has heard yet yeah I think we're excited about that just we we feel like we're an album band more than a single driven band so we're excited to for people to hopefully hear the whole the whole you know, product, not that it's a product, but the whole finished thing. And headlining tour coming up, what are you guys most looking forward to with that? Uh, just, you know, going around and, and playing to more of our fans and building a fan base here and, and, and that really, just, you know, playing more shows. It's, it should be amazing. Awesome. Well, congratulations on all your success and um, I'll talk to you guys next time you're here. Sweet. Thank, Thank you very, you very much. Nice Bye to guys. meet you. Nice to meet you too.